Hi guys, Sorrel Nightingale here, and today I want to um, talk to you guys about music and witchcraft. Now, as a very musical person, um, music means a lot to me, and it is incorporated into my craft quite a bit. Um, I sing songs while I read tarot. I um, use lyrics in my incantations. I sing and I play music and when I'm doing spells or I'm meditating or anything to that tune. Um, and when you're using um, music in your witchcraft and in your practice, it's all about correspondences because different songs mean different things to different people. You can play the same song for ten different people and get ten different emotions that it evokes within them because it's all about how the lyrics ring true to you and it's all about what kind of emotions that they might bring up and I sing different songs or I'll use different types of lyrics in different types of spells like I can sing, like, you know that if I was to sing, So honey, now, take me into your loving arms, you know that that's really tender and it's sweet and it's loving and it's crooning. And you know that that really evokes a certain type of, um, like, that love energy. The Like, it rings true to most people that that's a love song and that's the type of emotion that it invokes. What if I was to sing, Ooh, solitude, still with me is only you. You know that that is crooning as well, but in a different way. And you know that that person is very upset, and they are calling, and they are trying to reach out. And I might use that song in a um, communication spell, um, if I was cursing loneliness onto somebody, and yes, I'm not a Wiccan. I do not abide by the threefold law. I do not believe in it. Um, I curse, and I'm proud to say that I do. But if that's not your thing, again, you do you. Um, and different types of music are better for different things. Like, if I was doing meditation work, I might use the instrumental versions of songs that mean things to me, just so that I'm able to go, I'm able to get into that meditative state of mind and not get caught up in the lyrics and get that side of my brain working. Um, I want to be very um, abstract when I'm meditating or I'm trying to move into the astral planes. I don't want to get hung up on um, trying to figure out words. And it, it may not be that way for everybody. Um, it's just that way for me because I have ADD, ADHD. So I'll focus on different things and I'll get stuck on um, words when I'm trying to do other things. So I can't listen to music while I'm doing work or anything because I will, whoop, I'll get stuck. and. In some ways it's good, some ways it's bad, because I can really get hung up on the emotion and hung up on the way that the song makes me feel if I'm doing spell work or tarot or something like that, but if I really need to concentrate, um, I, I typically use the instrumental version of um, songs, just because it makes it easier for me personally. Um, so yeah, that is pretty much what I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, I will talk to you guys later. This is Sorrel Nightingale. Good health to you and yours. Signing off. Good night.